that you rascal surrender unto me. You are all rascals, you surrender to Krishna. Then your life will be successful. This is the sum and substance of Krishna's instruction. Sarva dharma an purittajya mami kam saranam bhajo. Krishna is not asking only Arjuna. He is asking all us, all us things, that you are manufacturing so many things for becoming happy. Never be happy. Rest assured. But surrender to me and I will make you happy. This is Krishna. That's all. One line. So the one who is intelligent, he'll take this process. That I have tried my best to become happy, but everything is failure. Now let me surrender to Krishna. That's all. And Krishna also has said, it is not my manufactured thing that I am saying everyone is rascal. The Krishna said, Namaga duskita nam mura prabaddhanti naradhama. Mura, rascals. Those who are rascals, they do not surrender to me. So our only test is if anyone has not surrendered to Krishna, he is rascal number one. Never mind his MA, PhD, DHC, or whatever it may be. But we take him as class rascal. Because he has not surrendered to Krishna. This is the test. We are simple because we are not very educated, but we take the words of Krishna. Krishna says that only these classes of men, what? The duskritino. Duskritino means one has got merit, but the merit is being engaged for sinful activities. Just like the atomic bomb, one who has Manufactured this. He has got merit, certainly. Great scientist. But how he has used his merit? To kill men. That's all. The men are being killed, sir. They are already dying. What you have manufactured? Man, no, I have got Nobel Prize. Why? I have invented something which is very quickly killed. That's all. Not slowly, but quick. And he is offered Nobel Prize. He has manufactured something. Why don't you manufacture something that man will not die? Then I could consider your merit. But no, his merit is utilized for doing something sinful. That is called duskriti. These classes are men. They cannot surrender to Krishna. Because they have to suffer for their sinful activities. So they cannot surrender. And surrender means you become free from all sinful activities. Om Tva Sarva Pāpe Bhama Krishna. Krishna is sure. If you surrender, then I immediately give you release from all the action of sinful love. But they will not surrender. They will, they will continue. They will suffer. Nama Angadis Kitana Mura. So Mura means rascal, fool. Krishna is giving so much opportunity, but he will not accept. Therefore Mura. And Naradhama. Naradhama is lowest of the mankind. This instruction can be taken in this human form of life. Krishna says, surrender unto me. A dog cannot do that, but a human being can do it. If he does not do it, then he is the lowest of the mankind. He is not taking the opportunity. Naradhama. But one may say that there are so many big, big men educated, learned. But Krishna says, māyaya purhita jnana, although they have learn so much, so many knowledge, still maya has taken it. The real knowledge has been taken. Asuri uh, bhavamasita, because they are demons and atheists, they cannot take it. So what can be done? Krishna is offering all opportunities and we, humble servant of Krishna, we are trying to please it, but the rascals will not accept it. What can be done? That is the difference. They want to continue to remain as rascals. That is what can be done. This is the difficulty. Otherwise, everything is there. If we take it, 
Even a child can take benefit out of it, a Krishna consciousness that you have seen practically. But we will not take it. That is the question was that we are all performing sinful activities. Hmm. We cannot come to the platform, platform of knowing Krishna as long as we have sinful activities. No. Even if we are sinful, Krishna says, therefore, you surrender. Krishna will take charge. You surrender. Then Krishna will take charge. Angkva sarva pape bhamokhaishthani. I shall give you release from all reactions. You haven't got to wait. So first of all, finish my business and suffering from sinful. No. As soon as you surrender to Krishna fully, Krishna, so long I was uh, in darkness, now I surrender unto you. If you like, you can kill me. If you like, you can maintain me. This is surrender. Then Krishna takes charge. And if you continue that surrender, then you are clean. But if you again come in, uh, that is your business. But if you really surrender, and as Krishna says, you do not do, uh, then you remain perfect. Even in this life, and as soon as you become perfect, you become eligible to go back to home, back to Godhead, then you are all problem solved. Taktādi haṁ punar janma naiti māmi Everything is there. This question was, how is it possible to obtain humility? That is in your hand. He you teaching that you become humble, make surrender. If you don't do it, that is your you have got the independence. That is your business. What is the humility? You are already surrendering to so many nonsense habits. Why not surrender to Krishna? The little intelligence that I have surrendered to my sense enjoyment. My senses are dictating to do something, and I am doing it. Uh, I am doing it. So my business is to surrender. So I have already surrendered to my sense activities, to my wings, to my whimsical activities. Why not surrender to Krishna? A little intelligence. You cannot be independent. Just like if you say that don't care for the government laws. You may say, but you have to take care. You have to take care. Similarly, you may say that I don't surrender to Krishna. Then Maya is there. Maya is there. Immediately she takes charge. Devidji Shagunamai Mama Maya Dhrutriya. Then you become servant of intoxication, these, that, so many things. But if you are intelligent, then you will understand your position that I have already surrendered to so many nonsense things. Why not give up this and surrender to Krishna? This is intelligence. So one who has no intelligence continues to suffer. What can be done? You cannot say that I am not surrendered. You are surrendered to your dictation of the senses. Because you are foolish, you do not know that I am working under the dictation of my senses. My masters are the senses. So why not accept Krishna as my master? This is easy. You cannot be free. That is not possible. I asked this question to one big professor in Moscow, communism. I asked him that what is the difference between your philosophy and our philosophy? You have accepted a leader, Lenin, and we have accepted a leader, Krishna. So, so far accepting a leader, there is no change, only in the process. See, if the leader is perfect, then the process is perfect. And if the leader is a rascal, then the process is also rascal. So he could not answer. So where is the communistic movement has advanced? There is no advancement because they have to accept one leader, surrender to somebody. But the man to whom he has surrendered, if he is perfect, then it is perfect. And if he is a rascal, the whole system is just. So therefore, our advice is that you have to surrender to somebody. The better surrender to the supreme perfect person, Krishna, than he will. 